Hello, my lovely viewer. Nice to meet you. Or nice to see you here again. It's me, Xenia. And I'd like to say you my small secret. I'm making this grating already after I filmed a video. It is so because I understood that video becomes too long, too large. And I decided to make it in a two parts. So right now you will be watching the first part of the video. This part will be about soft and hard sounds. Today you will understand when we have to pronounce which sound. So be sure that you will get tons of new information in these two videos. That's why I would ask you to concentrate. But if you are ready and you are interested in new knowledges and you are not afraid, we can start. the viewer again just before we start I'd like to give you some plus information if you were very attentive you could already find out that we've been talking about vowel letters and consonant letters and I said no word about two letters in Russian language. It is soft and hard science. So I'd like to say that these letters are not consonants or vowels. They are just by themselves. And today we will speak about them and I will show you how they work. So now the viewer, the first combination that we will speak about it will be hard and soft sounds with vowels. So right now you will understand when we have pronounced soft sound, when we have pronounced hard sound. So if we got consonant letter and after it goes E, we pronounce consonant sound in a soft way. I will give you some examples. In the word kit, 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 you see we pronounce letter K as soft sound k, 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 just because after this consonant there is letter E. Kit, kit, kit. Some more examples in the word vit, vit, vit. We have letter V and we pronounce it in a soft way. We say v, vit, vit, vit. And the last word for your example is pita, pita, pita. Also, we pronounce this word first consonant sound in a soft way pi 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 pita it is so just because after consonant there is vowel letter e the next situation when we pronounce soft consonant it is after two sound letters you do remember two sound letters it is Ya, yo, you, ye. And I call them two sound letters because they contain two sound. In the first place it goes consonant sound ye, and then it goes one sound letter. So when we got consonant letter, and after it will be two sound vowel letter we pronounce this combination as 
We pronounce consonant sound in the soft way and then we pronounce one sound letter which is the pair for two sound letter and consonant sound y just disappears it not longer should be pronounced for example you do remember that vowel letter ya contains two sound y and a if we got a word where before ya will be consonant letter we will pronounce it in a different way for example word miata 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 first we've got consonant letter m and then we got letter ya and you see we already don't pronounce it as a miata miata we it's not correct we don't pronounce it like this we pronounce it like miata so our consonant becomes soft and we already do not pronounce consonant y which were in the two sound letter ya we pronounce just miata mi a ta miata some more examples vowel letter yo contain two sounds y and o and in the word like tiotia we will pronounce consonant letter t as soft sound t and after we pronounce just o y consonant sound y disappears another example vowel letter u contain two sounds consonant sound y and vowel letter u in the word любовь 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 we already don't pronounce vowel sound u we pronounce just u and our consonant becomes soft любовь 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 and the same situation will be with vowel letter е which contains consonant sound y and vowel sound e but in the word like вера 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 we pronounce consonant sound in the soft way we pronounce v v and then we pronounce just e it's not already ye so we say vera 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 i hope this information made you excited <laughs> and the last situation when we pronounce consonant in a soft way it is when after consonant letter goes soft sign so you could understand that soft sign has such a name because it makes consonants before him soft some examples for you word tma 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 you see there is soft sign and it makes consonant letter before sound soft so we pronounce t -t -t, soft tma 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 another example word день 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 you see that in the end of this word we pronounce already consonant n in the soft way we pronounce n n it is just because after consonant we've got soft sign which makes consonant before sound soft and now let's talk about when we pronounce sounds in a hard way and i think that some of you already guessed that we pronounce consonant in a hard way when 
after it goes one sound letters except e so it will be letters a o u u e one sound letters and here some examples for you so you could check me for example word papa 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 you hear that i pronounce consonants in a hard way it is because after consonant we've got vowel letters a a pa pa the same situation with o for example word tort 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 you see i pronounce consonant letter t as hard sound t t is because after it we've got vowel letter o tort 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 the next word with vowel letter u the word is look 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 i pronounce consonant letter l as a hard one look l l look 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 with letter u i also got an example for you and the word vimya 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 you hear i pronounce consonant letter v as a hard one because after it we've got one sound letter u so i say vimya 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 and the last word with the letter e in the word matter 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 i pronounce consonant sound m in a hard way just because after it i've got vowel letter e so i pronounce matter 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 and the last situation when we pronounce consonant sounds in a hard way it is when after consonant we've got hard sign i guess you could also know that because hard sign makes consonant sound before sound hard and the example for you is word объявление 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 you already know that to sound vowel letter ya should make consonant sound before it sound soft but we've got hard sign between consonant and two sound letter ya that's why ya two sound letter can't influence to the consonant b because it's too far and hard sign helps us and we pronounce letter b as a hard sound b so we pronounce объявление 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 b in a hard way and lovely viewer look at the table here you get all the rules together i would recommend you to write down this table and learn and now lovely viewer could ask me how to pronounce consonants from the exception which could be only soft or only hard so for this letter no matter who makes a pair for them we pronounce as we learned if it's hard we pronounce it hard if it's soft we pronounce it soft and here we got some examples here we got letter j and you do remember that this letter is always pronounced in a hard way it's always hard sound j but how to pronounce if after j we've got one sound letter e which should make 
consonant before soft, but not in this situation. So we pronounce consonant z as it is, but our e becomes u. Yes, here we need a help of the sister of e. So here we got an example word rit rit rit. You see, in this word, we've got vowel letter E, but we still pronounce Z as a heart, and then we pronounce U, rit, rit, rit. But what should we do if after always hard letter, we've got two sound vowel letter? Like, for example, yeah. How to pronounce in this situation? So, we pronounce Z hard, but our Y in this situation also disappears. And we pronounce only one sound. So, for example, in the word Zhele, 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 you see we've got vowel letter ye but we pronounce it as e it's one sound pair e but z we still pronounce in a hard way zhele 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 some more examples consonant letter sh and we pronounce it always hard for example word shit Shit, shit. You see, we again pronounce sh in a hard way, and then we pronounce not e but u. Shit, shit, shit. Or word chef, chef, chef. Again, we pronounce sh in a hard way, and then we pronounce not two sound letter, but we pronounce it pair from the one sound letter E. Chef, chef, chef. The same situation will be with always hard TS, TS, TS. We pronounce CIRK, CIRK, CIRK. Or ZURICH, ZURICH, ZURICH. I pronounce U, not U. And TS still hard. ZURICH. Zurich, Zurich. So I hope you understood how we pronounce always hard consonants. But what should we do with always soft consonants? We also should pronounce them as they are, no matter what stands after it. And here we got some examples. For example, in the letter sh, we've got sound sh which is always soft, but here is the word shavil, shavil, shavil. You see that after consonant, we've got one sound letter R, and we should pronounce actually sh in a hard way, but there is no situation when we do this. That's why we still pronounce consonant sh in a soft way, and then we just pronounce a. Ah. So we say shavil, shavil, shavil. Nothing changes. Or, for example, always soft sound ch, ch, ch. And the word chan, 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 chan. You see, I pronounce ch in a soft way, and then I pronounce a. Ah. Chan, chan. Chan. And with consonant sound y, we also do not change anything. We pronounce it in a soft way as it is, and then pronounce one sound letter. For example, in the word yot, 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 we pronounce y in a soft way and then o. You see, very easy. All you need is just learn all of this. <laughs> Lovely viewer! 
Here is another table about always hard or always soft consonants. Pay attention to the column with red text. There I mention hard and soft signs. Hard and soft signs don't have their own sounds. They just make consonant before them hard or soft. But when it is consonant which is always hard or always soft, hard and soft signs can't change it. So we pronounce always hard with soft sign like just hard sound. For example, word mush, mush, mush. You see, in the end of the word we have soft sign. But as before it we've got always hard consonant sh, we pronounce sh hard and soft sign makes nothing. And we would pronounce always soft with hard sign, like just soft. But I can't find out such examples, because they are unusual for Russian language. So also, I would recommend you to write down this table and learn it. Lovely viewer, that's it for this first part of the video. I hope it was helpful. I hope you find out tons of new information and you understood, really understood when we have pronounced hard and when we have pronounced soft sounds. Write me in the comments how helpful this video was for you. If you have still some questions, also please ask and I will try to answer. And of course, we will see each other very soon, because the second part of this video also will be very soon. And stay tuned, so I could really ration you. Bye-bye, lovely viewer. Bye-bye for today.